Beach Rodeo Arena in 1984 for the 100th episode of the show, which did feature a rodeo. Now, altogether, there were 356 episodes of the original Dallas. The new series had three seasons, but it was canceled last fall. Now off to your right, that big building over there, that is our event and conference center. It's around 63,000 square feet, multiple ballrooms inside that building, and we use it for a little bit of everything. Uh, we've had dog shows, uh, we've had weddings, and we've had most everything in between in there. Uh, on average, we do about 1,000 events per year out here on the ranch. Now, South Fork is 340 acres in size. It's no longer a real working ranch, but we keep a, a pretty wide variety of livestock around. Uh, we have everything from llamas that were uh, donated to us a while back. Kind of a uh, rescue type situation. Uh, we have quarter horses and American paint horses. They're over to your left and you'll see them scattered around the ranch. Uh, we have a couple of miniature horses up here. Oh, you're right. Oh, that, there's one of the llamas there. Morning, Bob. <laughs> And then somewhere over there are some of our longhorns. Uh, I usually just point in that direction because I never really know where they're going to be. They kind of go where they want when they want, so we'll just see as we go. Now coming up here on your left, this first little barn is called the Party Barn. And the little house over there next to it with the white columns, that is Elena's Cottage. Now, they did film in both of those. They also filmed in each of these little barns coming up on your left and right. And after your tour of the house, you're welcome to walk around the ranch. The barns and Elena's are open. And behind Elena's cottage, right out the back door, is the car that Jock Ewing drove on the show. It's a 1978 Continental. Beautiful car. You may want to go out back of Elena's and take a couple of pictures of that car. Uh, there are no restrictions on pictures here at the ranch, so when you're in the house or anywhere else, take all the photos you want anywhere you want. Now these uh, barns and the corrals, uh, oh, there's a couple of the uh, longhorns over here. There's one of the calves up there. Now these uh, barns and the corrals, they're all original to the ranch. Uh, they were built by the original owner, Joe Duncan, back in the early 1970s. He raised quarter horses here then, and uh, at that time, the ranch was known as Duncan Farms. Uh, Mr. Duncan actually built the house and built and uh, developed the ranch here. Of course, that was well before it became known and famous as South Fork Ranch. Here on your right is a little replica cemetery plot with headstones for Jock, Miss Ellie, and J.R. They are engraved over on the other side. Really popular photo spot. Back side of that event center. And we'll turn here to go on to the house. But as we turn, uh, coming up on your right will be Miss Ellie's Deli. Uh, sandwiches, snacks, cold beverages, ice cream. He might want to check it out. And in addition to the filming that they did out on the ranch, uh, they filmed most of the exterior scenes for both the original and the new series right around the house. Uh, 
uh, swimming pool patio. Uh, they also filmed on this drive. It's called International Drive. And they filmed on it whenever they wanted to show the, the Ewings or someone entering or exiting the ranch. One of the prettier places on the ranch, I think. Nice little canopy created by these live oak trees. And we'll turn in here to the house. And when we uh, pull up here and get stopped, if you would, exit over on the left-hand side of the tram. We're going to go in that little opening there that you'll see between the hedges. I will meet you up on the patio, and I'll collect your little uh, tickets as we go in for your tour. I do want to thank you all for coming out. really do appreciate it, and I hope you enjoy your tour.